guys and welcome back to some more Hypixel Skyblock. Wow, I'm actually uploading and I just wanted to give a quick shout out to all of the Code Refraction enjoyers because you guys are the ones keeping my heating on as we descend into winter with this terrible upload schedule, which I am trying to fix. It's good to see you all again. I hope you're all well. This is really awkward. I wanted to kickstart this stream with the brand new Halloween quest because this guy has decided to rear his ugly head once again, but it appears that Sky Skyblock is celebrating Christmas. So this is a bit strange, but regardless, if you all remember this guy last year, I had a right game with him, dude. He sent you on a scavenger hunt to find a full armor set of spooky armor and a spooky staff, which you can use to troll players with. It was wonderful. And I'm so glad mods updated to finally remove all of the trolls that thing could give you because people were stream sniping me and attacking me with this staff, making me think I'd been kicked from my guild, making me think I'd lost coins. It was not good, man. So I'm glad to be done with that, but they've brought the quest back. Thankfully, I already have the great spook armor, but they've decided to add an accessory. So I can't even skip this. Before, you know, it was just a cosmetic set of armor and a staff. It didn't really do anything. Now I actually have to listen to this guy's BS to progress in the game. So I already have all of this stuff. Only now he's added a set of equipment, which seems entirely useless as the armor once was. Don't know if I want to go for that. A sword Grants plus one damage and plus one strength for every fear you have. Uh, okay. And these are the more important items. The Great Spook Talisman, the Ring, and finally, the Artifact. I'm not going to do what I did last year, though, because I can't believe it's been a year already. Maybe the pain is just still that fresh in my mind. But if any of you remember me attempting this last year, I tried to do it with no guides, with no help from chat, nothing. And it was utterly miserable. Almost as miserable as going to him and trying to get the damage exact of 333,300. 33 damage with no guides. Only this is ridiculous. Like to get some of the armor pieces, I remember you had to use a wither bow with icy arrows and shoot bats on your private island. How the hell is anyone going to figure that out? I mean, clearly somebody did, but I don't understand it. Thankfully, we're fashionably late as always. So there's already guides all out there for these items. So I'm going to save you all from my stupidity today and shout out my boy Seven Blade, who made a full on forum guide on how to obtain every single one of these items. So thank you. Bless up. So firstly, we need the Great Spook Talisman, which gives us plus two fear. And that's literally it. Although I guess we're getting magic power from it. So why not? We need five fairy wings, which according to the guide, we need to go into dungeons with a pair of enchanted shears and right click some fairies, which is easy enough. I honestly possibly could have figured that one out. I don't want to give myself too much credit though, because I can be a little stupid sometimes. So thank you guys for bailing me out and saving what dignity I have left. Let's get into some dungeons. You're gonna die. You're naked. I can't die. It's floor one. Do you have that little faith in me briefing? I, I wanted to kill that guy just to prove a point. I'll kill this guy just to... Oh, not enough mana. Oh, he's bowing me and it's not even taking my health down. <laughs> That is actually adorable. Anyway, let's get up in here and shear ourselves some fairies. Boom, boom. How many of these do we need? Five, right? And we already have absolutely everything we need. Thank you very much, Mr. Briefing. Great spook talisman. That was easy enough. Thank you, sir. What do I need for the next one? We need two free spiders. I would have gotten completely stumped on this one. Like the first, maybe without giving myself too much credit, I could have figured that out. This, I don't have a freaking clue what free spiders are. Coincidentally, we do actually have to go to the spider's den. I would not have figured this out in a million years. All I know is we need some mad trickery to come in here and free these spiders in this cage. I don't even know the method to open this, so we're going to go cheese it with the guide immediately because it's probably going to be some absolute BS if it's anything like last year's hunt. What in the good and holy crap did I just read? Wait, so firstly, I need to open this random obscure cage up in grandma's house for free spiders, like the most ambiguous term ever. And the first step is to go to the crystal hollows and get a scavenged emerald hammer and a scavenged gold hammer and combine them together? My brain is too small for this game. I am so glad you all do the heavy lifting for me, for real. I contribute nothing to this community besides my idiocy, and I'm glad you're all here for it, because my god, I would be useless otherwise. Right, now to find ourselves the Mines of Devan. There we go, one out of two. Golden hammer. Now, what do I do with these? I gotta go to the anvil in the gold mines and merge them? Do I have to go to that specific anvil? Surely... 
What? Scavenged iron hammer. Strong enough to break the toughest bars. Let's go free some spiders. This quest makes absolutely no sense. I am going to be straight up with you, lads. If I couldn't anvil those items together and I was like an Easter egg hunter and I was trying to figure out this quest, I would not think the anvil would work in a different lobby. Who thought to even try that? Right, let's free some spiders. Hey, how many of these do I need? Actually, I have no idea, but I'm going to get even more of them. Why not? Free at last. Oh, I only need two? Oh, easy. Well, we've got an extra free spider. Great spook ring plus four fear costs the great spook talisman and two free spiders. Thank you very much, sir. What do we need for this one? Thank you, game. This is really, really, really useful. This time, I'm going to need a burger. It's hmm, quite important, you see. Not cook, just bring me the ingredients. And no tomatoes, please. And no pickles. My guy. My guy. Anti-tomato and anti-pickle gang. I hate both of those things every single time I get a burger. Both of those are gone immediately. This is how a burger should be enjoyed. Who asked? We wow, I didn't realize I reinstalled Twitter. I know where we can get some of these things myself. I'm not stupid. What goes on a burger we need onions lettuce that also goes on it okay we got some things ourselves knowing me i've probably already done that wrong what else do we need oh i actually did need that we need bread cooked beef tasty cheese and french fries all right i know how to get most of that stuff we're golden the only thing i don't know about is the french fries i'd have assumed that would be in the builder but it's clearly not so i'm guessing that's the part that involves the minion but we can do the rest we got our two bread bun for the top bun for the bottom let's get ourselves some boeuf oh nico's got it set up for me thank you king apparently the way to do the french fries is to set up a potato minion and put a hunter knife in its upgrade slot i mean you can't knock the admins for their creativity with this stuff you really can't but what the hell how on earth did somebody figure this out please tell me putting a hunter knife out of every single weapon in hypixel skyblock someone figured this out put it in a minion and realized that it makes french fries I want to see it happen. <gasps> Let's go, dude. A perfect side. And I think we have everything to make our burger. Wait, I'm missing the most crucial part. Boom. Some tasty cheese. There we go. That is looking like a snack, bro. Call that refraction. Please say I have everything. Enjoy your burger, you fat frick. You know, all things considered, I've had worse assistance before. You did an all right job, Robin. What's your name, right? I mean, you got the first and last letters, right? I don't know if that's actually what they did with the code or if that's the generic name they use. And it's just a really weird coincidence. But well, that's actually pretty good. Anyhow, I have to prepare for the next great spook. See you next year. I am not looking forward to it, I can't lie. Oh, there's also a little event shop like that in the hubs. Hide and squeak rat skin, zombie bee skin, and a paranormal black cat skin so i guess we got, just gotta play and earn ourselves some event silver for all of this stuff not sure how i have 370 i literally have not logged in but guess we're buying the mythic one i just bought the talus off the ah i couldn't be bothered wait oh it's not even soul bed oh my addition is gross why am i so late to everything man oh well we got it that's all we need actually there's one thing we need to do boom a new epic accessory. I don't know if it's really worth going for the rest of the stuff considering it's like entirely useless, but I guess last year I put myself through so much suffering for this despite it being useless, so I may as well get the rest. And the fact you can make this sword divide is actually pretty sick. So yeah, I do want to get the sword. We need five dead seeds. To the forums we go. To get the sword, go to the farm merchant and purchase five enchanted bone meal and then go to the graveyard. You can right click on a dead bush in the graveyard five times with the enchanted bone meal until you get five dead seeds used for the sword. Oh, it's actually really not even that mind-bending. The quests have been mad, so to read one that's actually not too difficult, I'm about, bro. Huh, that really is super easy. For what? Just a free legendary sword that you can make divine? I mean, obviously, its stats are atrocious, but that's not so bad, honestly. I don't know why anybody wouldn't get that. Once again, I have an absolutely atrocious addition, but that's fine. This looked better in my head. Still progress. We're only a few more terrible ideas away from success. Why do I feel like that's every single Hypixel Skyblock admin meeting ever? So we need a wood singularity. And a recombobulator. That's actually pretty cool to have a non-bugged divine sword. Before any of you say, no enchants are going on this thing, least of all Chimera. I don't know what is wrong with you apes. It scales in strength based off of how much fear you have, right? So I have fear off the accessory. I have my old great spook set, so we can wear that and we can see how much damage we do with this bad boy. So now we have a whole 20 fear. Ooh. 
16,000 damage. That is atrocious. How much does it scale with fear? Hold up. Oh, wow. It actually scales quite a bit with fear. I guess naturally now we just have to get the equipment. Also, what the hell is this guy? Please tell me where I can go to find my hope. Fam, you're level 82. Your private island is where you should be going. Oh, I can vote on where you should go? I mean, the end's about right for level 82. Yeah, let's do it. Do you know one of the key pillars to my success besides gathering resources? Training in my craft. These zombies might be mindless, but they seem to know how to kill. I mean, yeah, if it's your first day on the game, perhaps it's because of their unfortunate pasts. What the hell is this guy on about? I've never seen this NPC in my life. Life. Regardless, they're easy to build up my strength. Believe it or not, my power seems to have dwindled during my long rest. My guy has grinded up to level 82 off of just graveyard zombies. Tempted to make a new profile and see how long that would actually take because that, that is a grind, my man. Fair play. Hang on. What happens if I vote, vote on a different thing? The high level. You seem to be very curious about this place. What is it you're hoping to hear? Honestly, I'd love to hear anything about the high level. For those of you that don't know what that, that area is, it's right here. This is the high level if you look in the scoreboard on the right-hand side. Being here since day one and they seem to be doing nothing with it everyone's so invested in the wizard tower but honestly this has always intrigued me more i want to know what on earth that is what do we need to do for these things great spook belt we need two rogue flesh for this we need precious i'm guessing that's a ring there is a ring you can fish up in the crystal hollows that is like the one ring is it giving him that have i just figured out something by myself i don't know we need obscure ending and a head of betrayal okay this is the only one i have any idea about and that's only because i've watch lord of the rings i could be very 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 wrong i clearly am very very wrong oh i thought i was on to something bro first the necklace to get the necklace you will need to make a blindness potion it looks like all we need to do is beat the end race in less than 42 seconds whilst blinded let's do it Oh, this is horrible. I haven't done this race in so long. I probably should have actually like looked at where I'm supposed to be going. <laughs> Blindness one is strong, you know. Isn't this supposed to be like a beacon or something? Let's try that one again. You see this next to my face cam? That's what we're going to use, boys. That is how we beat this challenge. We note down the cowards of the end beacon and of the start beacon. Start podium. Neg 500, 121, neg 240. All right, so let's practice. Nico sent me the end cowards. Neg 774, 101, neg 299. Okay, so just go up, avoid the spikes. Neg 774 and neg 299. So around here... Oh my gosh, we nearly fell into the void. Let's see how close we were. We were actually super close to, to it. Okay, so for our first practice run, not so bad. I'm feeling confident, lads. Absolutely no reason for this level of confidence, but I'm feeling confident. <laughs> first attempt, or proper attempt. 774... 299. I've gone too far. <gasps> I can see the beacon! You can actually see it when you get close to it? Oh my god, that's sick, that's sick, that's sick. Now all I need is neg 500, neg 240. Dude, I landed like right on it. What are the chances that I'm whiffing? How do I do that? Only I can do so well and still fumble the bag. Oh, no shot. Give me my obscure ending. Let's go, dude. <laughs> there is actually no way we just did that. I whiffed that so hard. I did not deserve this at all. Now get this blindness away from me. You all are saying a cow head helps with this, right? Oh, that's not even working. All right, well, sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Give me my great spook necklace. Thank you very much. Speaking of cow heads, you need to take a cow to Jake now? All right, sweet. Okay, so you're talking about the cow head. You're talking about taking a cow to Jake. Is the head of betrayal using a cow head and taking a cow up to Jake? That would make sense. I figured out which item it correlates to. I'm really tired of this blindness, bro. I didn't realize three minutes could last so long. It's like the last three minutes when you're in class and it just seems to never end. Oh, now the cow head's decided to work. Thank you. Yes, that's the way you do it. Look at me, piecing things together with my own mind. I cannot wait to get stream sniped and have every single cow I ever find killed mercilessly in front of me. But let's go try and find one. Oh, the cows are in the desert. I have to drag it over from the barn. Yeah, I definitely need to get myself some tarantula boots. Also, sick name, my guy. Thank you for the five as well explosion saying you think lasting three minutes is long. Didn't even think it was possible. Yeah, for real. The fact that three minutes seemed like an eternity right there gives us some hope, lads. <laughs> We're saved. <laughs> now fly with me, son. <laughs> This looks so stupid. Honestly, this is ridiculous. This is the kind of absurd quest that I love. Oh.
That's the thing that should give me the head of betrayal, bro. That is arguably worse than giving it to Jake. I don't know what Jake intends to do with it. Let's take it nice and slow. Come with me and you'll be in a world of eternal damnation. Why do I keep killing all of these cows? Thank you for the three as well, Drew. Cal get like 10 cows on leads at the same time and use the launch pad from the barn to the desert. Only a few cows will survive the journey, but it's good. <laughs> We're trebucheting them now? You know, I actually want to see that. That'd be kind of hilarious. I need a new lobby, though. This one's getting invaded. Let's go! What kind of rat don't overstop, bro? <laughs> they, they didn't even move. Oh, I've still got the lead attached. Oh, no. Could we be? It was so close. Okay, we got the strats down now. We look down and spam shift. So what we got to do is take him to the highest point on this side first. So we go up here. This is the way. What on earth is awaiting me on the other side? Oh. Ah. No! Why must he perish? Come on. This is like landing a helicopter. I'm going to need a total of corruption, bro. Oh, this poor guy trying to kill the farm animals normally. <laughs> Enjoy taking 100 hits to kill a chicken. Imagine if that's how you just make all the new players quit Hypixel Skyblock, go in the barn, corrupt every single mob. They're like, dude, this game sucks. It's so pay to win. I have to buy a Hyperion just to kill a chicken. Is this the cow? Is today the day, Hector? Well, let's take him over to the Oasis. Oh my God, we're doing it. No, dude! This must look so stupid to everyone else in this lobby. <gasps> Yo! Wait! I got too excited, man. I went too fast at the end. I'm so mad at myself. Don't say I can shear a mushroom cow, chat. That would actually break me if that's a thing you can do. I've decided my boy Jake, he deserves the best. He sits on top of a mountain in a desert all day, every day, just waiting for someone to bring him some food. He deserves the most premium quality beef going. He ain't having no mushroom cow. He can have that anytime he wants. He is getting pure cow. Let's go. It's actually on the desert. Oh, I'm so happy. Now, all I got to do is get him up here and hope that nobody stabs it to death. This is my first time being here, apparently. What's going on? Clearly very good to my co-op with the amount of pelt grinding that I do. I don't even know where Jake is. Mm, every time it takes damage, I cringe a bit. Oh, it's having a bad time. He's in that hut over there. I've taken him to the wrong peak. You know what? We're tarantula booting it. Wait, the longer it's in the air, the more full damage it takes. Oh, Christ, on a bike. <gasps> that thing has to be on one HP. And Jake is right there. Oh, my God. Mm. I can't make the jump. No, dude. What? We got a sniper now? That's so try hard. There's actually somebody sat on a mountain somewhere. Sniping? Fam thinks he's playing Call of Duty. We are so close. Please, please stick with me here, man. Okay, I've got your best interests at heart. I don't know what on earth Jake wants to do with you, but frankly, that's none of my darn business. I just heard someone shoot an arrow. Stay away! Please! No! Stop! Please! I don't need the stress! I don't need the stress. I don't need... <laughs> Please be kind. Please be kind. I will give you 5 million coins if you do not kill this cow. This cow is worth... 5 million Hypixel Skyblock coins. If you do not kill it, I will give it to both of you that are chasing me right now. But I'm messing up my jumps because I'm stressing out. I'm not even going up the right mountain. Mm, it's dead. Wait, how is that guy just doing it down there so nonchalantly? He's not got a care in the world. I wish I was as sick as him. What's going on? This guy doesn't even look like he needs 5 million coins. Don't be pressing that left click button, brother. Every time you left click, that's minus a million coins. Oh, he looks so far away. Oh, that was a big body slam. Oh, and again. Oh, we hate that. <gasps> Jake, take him from me. Yes, dude. Oh, I thought I accidentally killed my cow with that left click at the end there. <sighs> oh, thank you. The head of betrayal. <laughs> It's crying. That's honestly how I feel right now. It's appropriate. 
and he sells you the cow axe because of it. You know what? I'm buying this as another trophy item. We're getting all the collectibles today, lads. Honestly, I kind of don't even want to give this to you, my man. I worked so hard for it, but we may as well get our great spook gloves for our plus five fear. That's some extra damage on the great spook sword, right? So let's see what it's like without the great spook gloves. We got a solid 5833, 5846, 5859, about 5.8k. Let's whack the gloves on. Solid, solid like 3,000 damage. You know what? Definitely worth the past error of my life. Oh, what next? Apparently an infinity dart wand. And go and talk to the dart guy in the Dwarven Mines. I remember seeing him. He's like hidden in that weird room all the way around the back, right? Give the NPC the infinity dart wand and he'll give you precious. What? I thought that had something to do with Lord of the Rings, man. I'm so disappointed. From memory, you have to go out here, down these stairs, and go onto the hidden minecart tracks here, right? And I think if you follow these around far enough, you eventually stumble across across the dirt room but i believe it's more on this side of the map i think it's like right here from memory there we go i'm actually the best in the game straight in there i love this room it is so absurd and i'm glad it actually finally has a use please take my infinity dirt one and i've got precious dirt precious <laughs> I'm so glad we had such an easy one after that last mess. <laughs> Give me my precious. Thank you very much. Now, the last thing we need is the belt to rogue flesh. To get the belt, you need to spawn a T1 Revenant Horror and let its timer go down to one second before killing it. Killing it with one second left will drop one rogue flesh. So we need to do that twice. I keep on saying this, but how do people figure this stuff out? What? See, the hardest part of this challenge is actually going to be not getting stream sniped and actually being entertaining for six minutes of being AFK, essentially. For regular players, this is nothing but a mere test of patience. For me, this is actually going to be probably the hardest challenge yet, which I hate to say. So let's do this. We only got another minute left. And thankfully, so far, nobody has found my lobby. I know there's probably countless people out there right now frantically spamming between her and doing slash warp crypt and if you're one of them have mercy oh dear god no please only 40 seconds left please say it's just some random friendly individual that wants to chat with me in this lobby no can i trust you you know what if it's just me and you in this lobby and i managed to do the other one you can have yourself a nice cool 25 millers boom there we go we got one rogue flesh and all we gotta do is afk for another three minutes Bro, I just noticed his teeth are block peepees. You have forever ruined Revenant Horrors for me. Oh my god. I was top five in the leaderboards for this for like a solid year. And I never once noticed the dude literally has a peepee -pee smack bang in the middle of his mouth. What the hell? <laughs> I've never seen that before. <laughs> hey, yo, Revenant Horror, you're kind of moving mad, my guy. Relax. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, he's friendly. Okay, this guy can have 12.5 mil. He can have half of what the other one was if he's a friendly mind man. Maybe people are just stream me at this point because I'm offering bribes to everybody. <laughs> please don't do it. Please don't do it. Please don't do it. Please don't do it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Boom. Thank you, gamers. That's actually Pog. We've officially collected all of the items. Even though I used guides this time around, that still took me an hour and 40 minutes. Guys, I think I just suck at the game at this point. Get our great spook belt. And there we go. Do you not give me dialogue now I've unlocked everything? Is it just an abrupt ending? Or is it because I need to get these items again? Because if that's the case, that is not happening, brothers. No, sorry. What if I put the whole armor on? I put all of the equipment on. Do I get an achievement for this? No achievement for having all the gear in my inventory. This is so sad. Yeah, he doesn't give me any dialogue with it. Let's see how much damage we do with the great spook sword. Now we're fully decked out. We got ourselves our max crimson armor. Warden helmet. G-drag. 41,000 damage. <laughs> that's so pathetic. <laughs> I mean, I guess it has no end chance on it, but still. Bleh. Never mind, I'm being stupid. It gains damage off of fear. I need to wear the spook set. Oh, we do even less. <laughs> Well, guys, that's the that's the Halloween Hunt 2022 edition. I hope you all enjoy it. If you did, please be sure to leave a like. That's a solid voice crack. This stream has really not gone my way. Consider subscribing if you aren't already. And uh, I hope you all have a great rest of your day. Peace.